What's up, hard workers? It's your boy Frankie Hardworker, and I'm super duper back with another one, y'all. Let's talk about it. So, with all the Diddy stuff that's going on, the Dame Dash topics that he be having, and just hip hop in general right now, I want to talk about a particular topic, right? And I want to ask a quick question Was Dame Dash right? And what I'm asking was Dame Dash right because in a video that I made, go check it out. It's a couple of Dame Dash videos. Just go check it out. Um, he spoke about the feminization of hip hop. And I'm about to show y'all this picture right here. As you can see who it is in this picture right here. This is Pharrell. Now, Pharrell, we all know his come up. If you've been around. I mean, Pharrell been around forever. He worked with Teddy Riley. He worked with a, a lot of people, but his come up, his come up, come up was the clips. You understand? Grinding. He made that beat, him and Chad and all of them, you know, Neptune and all that. And, you know, not saying he was a thug or anything like that because he never was a thug. The name of their group was called The Nerds. So, you know, he, he was, a you know, a certain type of character, a certain type of dude. But around that time, he wasn't dressing as if you see in this picture right here. You understand? As this picture, as you see right here, because... I'm going to show other pictures of him. And I'm pretty sure we all know pictures of him. But when you look at this picture and you think about what Dame Dash said and you think about hip hop as a whole right now, the feminization of hip hop is horrible. Like, and I, I'm not saying, I'm not, I have nothing against anybody. If you're going to be yourself, be your true self. Those are the ones I respect because they being they self. You feel me? I don't respect the ones that, um, that acting like they, they this and they that. But then, like, years later, when everybody, like, it seemed like everybody got their head turned. Now you come out like, hey, guys, I'm I'm, I'm binary. And it's like, are you doing this for the money, fam? Because that's, that's what it seemed like to me. It seemed like people is becoming feminized because of the money. It don't even seem genuine to me. Like, these dudes, it's like, yeah, this is me. Like, for instance, where you got, you got rappers, some rappers. I don't want to, you know, you got rappers that actually come out wearing skirts. You understand? See, and then it started with the bags. And, I, and I'm going to keep it a buck. It really didn't start with the bags. It started before that. You understand? Like, and I'm going to tell y'all when it started. Like I said, about like 10 years ago, right? I can remember being in the store. I, I was in the city somewhere, if I'm not mistaken. Shopping or whatever. So I happened to, to walk in a certain area. And I'm like, oh, damn. I'm in the female area. Dude, like, nah. I'm like, you sure look at the pants. The pants was like tight. And like a female cut. And I'm like, these is for men? But this the killer though. It wasn't at that. He said, nah, these are kids. We're going to have the men soon. So they started at a young age. The next thing you know, you start seeing the bags. You understand? But how they got you with the bags was, it was stuff with money and, and weed and, and bud. And, you know what I'm saying? And different things that attract you. Like, yeah, like, yeah, I got my ratchet right here. You know what I mean? With that ratchet, blicky, whatever y'all want to call it. You know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? So you looking at it like, oh, that's kind of cool. You know what I'm saying? He got the rat up in there. You know what I mean? He got the money in there. He got some valley to bud up in there. He he doing him. You know what I'm saying? So, you know what I mean? You looking at that like, all right, that's thorough. So now people going on. But now it's getting worse. Because even with Young Thug, when Young Thug was wearing, he wore a complete dress. Like a, a dress. We seen that. He, if I'm not mistaken, I think it was a wedding dress. We seen that years ago, and now when you look at Thug, you wouldn't even think about that. But it already started already. You understand? Like the feminine, because remember, and this is no, no, I'm not throwing nothing at you know, that young Thug. I, I rocks with his music, he, he, whatever. You know what I'm saying? But it was a time where people thought him and Lil Uzi was on something different. You feel me? You understand? And they actually encouraged it by the two pictures they were taking. Certain movements they was doing, things of that nature. But now it's like, you know, Ozzy keeping it going, as you can see. So this is clearly him. You know what I'm saying? But Young Thug, now he caught up in, 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 in the Rico case. You understand what I'm saying? And from what I heard, Young Thug wasn't even on that type of time before that. You know what I mean? When I say that type of time, I'm talking about wearing dresses and stuff like that. You know, the hood he came from, what, Cleveland? Something like that? That's the hood. So you, you get what I'm saying? That's what I'm saying. Like, it's like... And this, and this ain't nothing to him. I'm just speaking about hip hop. It just seems like people is becoming feminized for hip hop. Even a certain outfits. Like I gotta give a shout out to my my, my guy, young Lil Baby. I, I rocks with Lil Baby. But since in the last year and a half, 
little baby clothes been crazy. Like the stuff that he been wearing, I don't like it. And, and it's, it's not a good look. You feel what I'm saying? No disrespect to the man. I'm, I'm just speaking on what's going on in hip hop. This is real talk. Because I rock with little, I rock with little baby. You feel me? So I want to know how y'all feel about this picture right here. Because this picture, this is really <sighs> for real. And he looked like a straight female or somebody that's in, the, in that community. You feel what I'm saying? Nothing against him. I'm just speaking on things. But y'all let me know how y'all feel about this. It's your boy Frankie Hard Work. Like, comment, subscribe. Easy.